another mod another day another day another mod <laughs> putting on my lauren links today so let's see how this goes hold up Welcome back to my channel. Is that what people say on YouTube? I really don't know. I'm still getting used to this vlogging thing. This video is two parts. Number one, how I felt about the Laverne Loring Links for my Vaquero. And number two, how I installed it. Well, first, let me give you information. I'm a shorty McShortster, a five foot five. So when I got this bike, it was a few people that told me, lower your bike, lower your bike. I'm just the type of person where, um, you can tell me something a million times, but until it clicks for me, it's not going to get done. I've dropped my bike twice, okay, <laughs> since I've gotten it. It's not very fun. I would put my foot down and there was no ground there, so the bike just tips over. In this clip, you can see that when I back my bike up, I reverse on my tiptoes, which is not very easy to do or comfortable or safe on an uneven surface. So these links were definitely overdue. This is what it looks like when I'm sitting stationary on my bike. It looks like my feet are firmly planted on the ground, but in actuality, I have to actually lean my bike either slightly to the left or slightly to the right so that I have a firm planting on either foot. I never really have a firm planting on both feet at the same time. So here's what my backing up looks like now with my lowering links installed. So before i was leading with the ball of my foot so i was putting pressure on the ball of my foot to back my bike up but now i'm actually using the heel of my foot rather the whole foot to back up which feels much more secure when i'm backing the bike up and here again is a still shot of me sitting stationary on my bike with the lowering links put on All right, so first, where did I get them? I got my lowering links from eBay. I think that's pretty much the only place they sell them. They sell them for the Vaquero and they sell them for the Voyager. I believe it's the same um, exact product, except if you install them on a Voyager, you're gonna have to do some welding because there's like a bar or something. Anyway, don't ask me, I'm not a mechanic. I've ridden 50 miles on them so far and that's just locally because that's where i dropped the bike the most in slow speed situations first of all it only took me an hour to put them on okay so technically it took me an hour and a half because i failed to read directions you'll see in the video later why that happened out the gate the things that i noticed as soon as just just riding out of my driveway when i rolled out of my driveway like i was flat footing rolling out <sighs> baby security Number two out the gate, what I noticed about the links was my arm position. I have 12 inch eights on my bike. I noticed that my arms were up, more upward and more straight. Much more comfortable ride, by the way. I was comparing two things to lower my bike. The first one was the progressive shocks. And the second thing was these links. Everybody just talked me into the links, so I got them. But for right now, the lowering links are perfect for me just to feel comfortable in my local riding. Tips! On installing your Laverne Lorraine links. Number one, read the directions and follow them. Okay. Um, because I learned the hard way that um, it's going to be hard for you to pull those shocks off if your bike is on the ground. No, you don't need a bike lift. You can do it while your bike's on the ground. I don't know how those people got the, that shock off unless they have like really, like really strong muscles and they were able to pull it off. But again, y'all will see in the video where I struggled with pulling the shock off because my bike was still on the ground. But when I lifted it, I was good to go. So follow your directions, folks. One of the last steps for the Vaquero owners is something about saddlebag extension. I didn't have to do that. You might have to, but I didn't. So I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I didn't have to do it. And the last thing is make sure that you tighten everything up. I didn't have that issue, but sometimes you forget. That is my take on the Laverne Loring links. I will post the link in the description along with um, some other things that are on my bike. Mm -hmm. 